Hey guys, so today I thought I would make a video that's a little bit more unconventional than my standard tech videos. I wanted to review a new product uh, in regards to shaving your head. Now currently I've been shaving my head with the Philips Head Groom for about the last two years or so. It's a great product. I've been using it with the clippers attachment without a guard. So basically I still have about a millimeter um, to two millimeters of hair after I shave my head. But as you guys can see, I mean, uh, my hair is pretty patchy. I especially, I have a big bald spot on the top. And I just think it's time to shave it all the way down to the scalp. Now I don't want to use a wet razor uh, with shaving cream. I'm not ready for that yet and I know it can be quite costly. So I still want to use something electric. And the Philips Head Groom does come with a balling attachment. I started using that. However, I, f I found that this attachment takes way too long to shave my head. It, it just takes way too long. Like 10 to 15 minutes is is way too long, especially if you're doing that every two days. And I think it's because of the shape of these blades. It's flat, so every time you go over it with your round head, you know, you really only do like a little section of it each time. And I would have to go over it multiple times for the hair to actually be completely gone. And uh, after I would do that, my neck and everything at the back here would be quite red and irritated. And even right now, it's still irritated from two days ago. So I need a new product. I wanted to, I wanna find something better that's, uh, that you can shave your head in under five minutes. And after shopping around on Amazon and online, I narrowed it down to the Pitbull Skull Shaver. Pitbull has different versions of this, from a silver edition all the way up to a platinum. Uh, and the one I got is the most expensive one, which is the Platinum Edition. I chose the Platinum Edition because it has a bigger battery. Uh, it has a stainless steel finish. It comes with a auto lock feature, so it doesn't accidentally turn on uh, in your luggage when you're traveling. It comes with a travel carrying case, as well as a holder to wash the blades in. So I'm excited for you guys today to unbox this product for you, shave my head for the first time, and let you know my thoughts on the uh, Pitbull Skull Shaver. Let's get into it. Okay guys, so it's a new day. I ran into some issues. As you can see when I was unboxing, I was trying to turn on the product and uh, it wasn't turning on. So I plugged it in and then as soon as I plugged it in, it started flashing this 53%. Um, so I thought it was charging uh, and unfortunately it wasn't. It said, I read the instructions, it says you have to charge it for about two and a half hours. Two and a half hours later, I checked again and it was still flashing the 53%. No indication that it was charging at all. Uh, and another issue that I have with this product is after unboxing it, I noticed that there was a whole bunch of scratches on top of the skull shaver. You can probably see that in the camera there picking that up. But it looks like this product's either been previously used or it was poor quality uh, in the manufacturing process. But all in all, I'm actually quite disappointed with that because uh, in Canada, I spent uh, $189.99 on this product and I thought that uh, it would be better quality. So I'm a little bit disappointed. So those are my two uh, concerns. And because of those issues that I'm having with this where it's not charging, uh, it's been sitting all night off the charger and it's still flashing this 53%, even though that it's off. So again, I'm very disappointed with this. However, the good thing is I did shave my head with it and it did do a pretty pretty good job as you guys can see uh, it was nice and close it was very quick when I shaved my head uh, it only took about probably about a minute and a half to two minutes that being said you know I am impressed with how quickly it shaved my head unfortunately though the cons outweigh the pros seeing that I don't even know if it's charged or not because it's still flashing the 
uh, and also the scratches all over the top. This is the Platinum Edition, so I wanted, you know, spending that kind of money, I want it to look perfect too. And those scratches look pretty significant, so I will be returning this product. I actually question Skull Shaver's quality of their products because on Amazon, there are a lot of people that have written that the pro their products are poor quality, and uh, that kind of just led me to the decision to not purchase another Platinum Edition uh, and order a new one. I'll just be returning this one and I'm gonna continue my quest for purchasing uh, a different type of head shaver that's better quality. So I'll keep you guys updated with that in another video. I'll uh, do some more research online. But like I said, I mean, it did do a pretty good job shaving my head. I like the length of the, my hair. Uh, I think it's a great length. It, it's, it suits me well, I'm quite happy with it. But unfortunately, uh, I won't be continuing with this product. I'll put a link in the description below for the skull shaver if you are interested. And if you subscribe, you'll see me in the next video. Talk to you guys later.